channel, to my channel, to my channel, 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 channel. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back to my channel. I'm Tia and I upload four times a week, Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, and Sunday. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and do so right now, okay? And if you haven't, you're one of my little doll babies. Hi, doll baby. How are you? Glad to see you. Today, I have a collaboration. I'm going to call it Ozzy Hair. It's a Amazon wig company. All the deets of the cap construction and, like, how I got her together and the price and everything will be down below. So, let me just get into this because... I have feelings. I have feelings about this wig. And now I'm getting for clip. I don't love it. I don't detest it, but I don't love it. There's a couple things. A lot of these things are preference. I don't like the super dark root. That's just me. The coloring is actually something I like. It's a blonde, but it's really like a peachy color blonde. Maybe like a rose gold hint. And I do really like that. This chick is silky, silky and long. Uh, she's giving me 30 inches. So this is one you'd have to wear all the way to the front. Like that's how I wear them so they don't get tangled. And it's going to get. Because she's getting tangled just me standing here. The calf construction is weird. I don't like her hair. Give me that twinkle. Uh -uh. So this is a skin top parting. Okay, and then there was like lace right here. I'm not really sure w why. Um, there's nothing that you could customize. And the wefts, like, do you see all this? This is just, I don't like any of this. So I did have to wear it sort of down. I did shift it a little bit. It's it's meant to be a middle part, but I shifted it just a little bit. I cut a little bit just so that I could tuck this behind my ear and make it look a little bit more natural. I don't 100% hate it. Um, especially because I'm pretty sure it's under $20, but I don't know. For me, this would just more be like a practice wig. If there's things you want to do to customize a wig, getting a wig like this off of Amazon or, you know, off of someone else is a good idea just because like it's inexpensive and then you can, with the length, you can start messing with like cutting, customizing the hairline, just so you don't like mess up your like expensive or the wig that you really, really like. <sighs> Yeah, I mean, that's really all I can say about it. I'm not, it's, it's, yeah, I, I don't, like, I hate saying that, but it's true. I just don't like this wig. I think for, like, photographs or for Halloween, this would be a great wig because, you know, like, it's pretty, but it's just gonna be a tangled mess by the end of the night and you're just gonna throw it out. So, that's my thoughts on this one. I'm always appreciative of the collaboration, but I'm always honest and I always, always try to find pros and the pros could be that this could be a great cosplay wig, but for like a fashion wear or a daily wear, um, it's shedding, it's snagging outside of the color. It's just, I'm not feeling it. So that's all I have for you. I hate to give negative reviews, but it's just the truth. So it is what it is. If there's another Amazon wig that you would like me to review, go ahead and put that down below. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. If you have, thank you so, so much. I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.
Thank you.